welcome back to my channel so for today's video i will be talking about the most important but the most neglected part of our skincare routine if you are new here please don't forget to subscribe to my channel i will try my very best to upload weekly so for today's video i will be telling you the importance of using sunscreen every day yes you heard that right that is every single day so as we all know for a fact that sun rays are always with us every day and too much exposure of sun rays may cause skin cancer in adulthood wrinkles discoloration dark spots sagging and blemishes and all and that makes you look so old now there goes the importance of wearing sunscreen every day so to start off sunscreen protects protects the skin from absorbing the ultraviolet rays and speaking of uv rays the sun emits three types of uv rays that is uva uvb and uvc but for today we will just be talking about uva and uvb so UVA is the ultraviolet A rays. So this ray penetrates through the second layer of our skin which causes wrinkles and premature aging. And this kind of rays penetrates through our window, door. So even if you work indoors, you still need to wear sunscreen. UVA, that's A for aging. So let's talk about the UVB rays. So UVB rays, ultraviolet B rays, and this rays causes sunburns. And too much exposure of this type of ray can lead to skin cancer in adulthood. So since both UV rays are harmful to our skin, we need a protection. And there goes the importance of sunscreen. We need to find a sunscreen that has a broad spectrum or the sunscreen that tells us we are protected from UVA or UVB rays. When choosing sunscreen, there is SPF and PA++. So talking about SPF, as I have done my research for this, I have found out two uses of SPF. SPF means sun protection factor. So in my first research, SPF 15 blocks 93% of the sun rays. SPF 30 blocks 97% of the sun rays, while SPF 50 blocks 98% of the UV rays. So we need to find a sunscreen that has an SPF 30 or higher. And as for another research, um, one meaning of SPF is the measure of time it would take a person to start getting red or start burning. So in general, it takes about 10 to 20 minutes for an average person to start burning without sunscreen. Now let's say you have a sunscreen that has SPF 15 on it. Now let's multiply it through the number of minutes that our skin starts to burn. Let's say 10 minutes. So SPF 15, 15 times 10, and that is 150 minutes. Let's convert that into hours. So 2.5 hours. So it says there that you will be protected for 2.5 hours. After 2.5 hours, you have to apply sunscreen again. Since you say you have SPF 30 times 10, that is 300 minutes. So let's convert that into hour. And that is the number of hours you will be protected. But that does not mean that you are fully protected for that number of hours. Dermatologists highly recommend that we reapply the sunscreen every two to four hours especially if you're exposed under the heat of the sun uh, i still don't know the exact meaning of spf but for all i know the higher the spf the better and we still need to reapply every two to four hours to just to be sure now let's go to pa have you ever noticed what pa means when looking at sunscreens or looking at makeups so pa means protection grade of uva rays so that is the protection of uva rays and uva rays as we recall it penetrates through our second layer of the skin which is the dermis and it causes aging so the more plus signs the more the protection from the uva rays so for this past month i have been trying two different kinds of sunscreen on my face first i have been using the bello expert perfecting shield tinted sunscreen yes the tinted sunscreen from bello and it already has spf 50 
and PA++++. When looking at sunscreens, you know what to look for. You need to find sunscreen that has a broad spectrum and that means you are protected from the UVA and UVB rays. Um, protection from UVA rays is the PA++ and protection from the UVB rays is the SPF. So the higher the SPF the better and the more plus signs of PA the better. So this is good because it gives you light coverage because it's tinted sunscreen. It has only one shade but don't worry it has this tone adapter technology which means it adapts to your skin tone as you blend it. I still bought this um, small size because I need to know if if he ang ako sa bello. Next, I have also tried the Super Screen Sun Gel SPF 50 Plus from Face Republic. So this is just their sample size, the sachet type. So for UVB rays, for um, for sunburns, you're protected because because it has SPF 50 and it has um protection from UVB rays which is the PA++ only three pluses not like sa Bello na tinted sunscreen it has four pluses sa PA so mas lamang to sa PA protection so protection sa UVA rays but days after using this I had breakouts I don't know if you can see it I had breakouts here but what's good about this this is the road to Korean glass skin this really gives you that glow na everyone would notice that healthy skin. Bello, this also gives you that um, glow, but this is super glowy good. So this is made in Korea, but I think you are more protected sa Bello tinted sunscreen than the Face Republic Super Screen. So I will try the um, Face Republic Sun Gel on my left part of the face and I will try the bellow on my right side of the face. For Face Republic Super Screen Sun Gel, it looks like this. It's um, a gel and it's kind of watery when you put it in your hand. So let's put that on our face. For me, this just has that strong smell. That's why maybe it irritates my skin because of that strong smell. See? It gives you that instant glow. And let's try the Bello Tinted Sunscreen on my right face. On my right side of the face. There, so that's tinted. It's kind of brown. It's not watery or not like the face or public sunscreen. So let's put that on our face. See? See? See the coverage? As you can notice, so kung napapansin nyo, yung Face Republic really gives me that glass skin. See? And the Bello Tinted Sunscreen is good. It gave that light coverage enough to cover yung mga little chismes and little blemishes sa face ko. But for now, I think I'll just stick to Bello because um, yun nga napansin ko sa Face Republic, um, nag-breakout ako, I had pimples here, here dito na part. 
And uh, maybe I'll use this again pag nawala na yung pimples ko para ma-prove ko talaga na face republic talaga yung naka-pop-pimples sa akin. So as I have also went through my research, you really need to find the sunscreen that fits for your skin. Yung hiyang na hiyang sa'yo kasi um, kasaga kadalasan talaga nagka-breakout dahil sa sunscreen baka dahil sa chemicals niya. But even though you we still need to have that sunscreen on our face, on our body, we still need to have that protection for us to prevent skin aging yung hindi tayo magmukhang matanda. So I suggest that you um, reapply every 2 to 4 hours if you are um, under the heat of the sun. So there, I'm done. Ang gusto ko lang ma parating sa video na to is I just really want to tell you how important sunscreen is for your face, for your skin. Especially now na grabe na yung init na na experience natin and we need to wear sunscreen every day not just during our beach days not just during summer but we need to wear sunscreen every day please please do wear sunscreen every day to prevent discoloration in your face you may not see it now but when you grow old you know there would be talungtong or yung mga item item yung mga mm, um, discoloration sa face nyo talagang lilitaw at lilitaw yan Kasi nga, the effects won't show this time. It would, ju it would just show as you age. So girl, don't skip that sunscreen. Wear sunscreen every day. So thank you so much for watching this video. And I really hope you learned something because that is my point on this video. I just want to share how we get that, um, how we get that wrinkles, how we get that discoloration on our face, on our face that blemishes. If may nakalimutan man akong sabihin, I will just pin it down sa comment section um, or I will put it sa description box. And if you have any comments on this video, I please feel free to comment down. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please don't forget to hit like and please don't forget to subscribe and click that bell button to be updated on my next videos. Thank you so much for watching and see you on my next video. Bye-bye!